it's CD8 Titan. I'm here to tell you how to partition a hard drive on Windows 7. We'll start off by opening your Windows bar, going to Computer, and right-clicking Manage. That'll bring the MMC Snap-in console. Then you'll go down to your storage devices and whatnot. Go down there, and you'll see C up right up in here, and you'll click Shrink Volume and then it'll query, making sure that it has space to do what it needs to do. And when it comes up, uh, how much you want to shrink it, then you just take, uh, let's see, well, I use five megabytes just for an example, or five gigabytes for an example. If you have, say, a new operating system that you want to put on there side by side, say a Linux distribution alongside a Windows 7 distribution, then you would go set aside like 50 gigs or whatever you wanted. And then you go in there, and after it's done allocating, it'll bring up a box. And it'll bring up a chunk of space on the right hand side, and the lower right hand, and the blue bars are, and it'll say, unallocated space on drive C. You go into that unallocated space, right cl or click once on the unallocated space, then right click, and then you will uh, click uh, create simple volume. You do that, you pick how big you want it, you pick a couple other simple things, usually just leave it normal. Pick NTFS or FAT32. I recommend NTFS because it's newer, it works better, and so on. And then there you go. And now, now what I'll have you do is I'll have you get rid of that volume. Say you're done using that partition and need to delete it. If you want to delete it and the uh, delete volume on the menu isn't isn't filled in, it's grayed out. If it's grayed in, that nine times out of ten means a page file's on there and using the drive. And it'll show up with an error saying, da da da, this has stuff. But now you 